Scientists are getting ready to head to eastern Iowa in day five of RAGBRAI. This is a map of today's route. Riders will travel nearly 89 miles from Des Moines to Tama Toledo. They'll pass through towns like Kellogg and Grinnell. Cyclists taking part in RAGBRAI had a hot day yesterday. They took off from Ames and ended in Des Moines, a shorter ride compared to previous days. Some riders woke up as early as 3.30 in the morning in order to beat the heat. TV9 Sports Director Scott Sable and First Alert Chief Meteorologist Joe Winters are taking part in the ride this year. We'll hear from Scott during the TV9 News tonight at 5 and 6. But first, Joe tells us how yesterday's ride was and how the heat is impacting riders. Good morning again from along the Ragbri route. Meteorologist Joe Winters in Des Moines after yesterday's ride, which took us from Ames to Des Moines. Rather interesting ride because once we hit Ankeny, it was city the entire way up until that point. And the nice cornfields to see in the soybean fields. But once we hit Ankeny, it was an urban bike ride. Very warm later in the day. That's the one thing we noticed certainly is that as riders were coming later and later, even though it was about a 55 mile ride, they certainly noticed the heat. And today that will be a problem as well as we have a longer ride we'll talk about in a second and also the heat is certainly going to be with us. Joining me now is Jordan Akers. Jordan is going to be a senior at Linmar High School. This is your third rag ride. Having a good time? Oh yeah, for sure. So let's say you've ridden three rag rides you said or this is your third. Um, have you noticed any differences on this year's rag ride? I feel like rag ride is always like a really big group but like I feel like this year I've been riding with a lot more people from around the world different states so I think that's really cool this year. Yeah, I've noticed that too. A lot of countries as well that were kind of represented. Now, what if somebody wants to, is young like you, and wants to do rag bra? What do they have to think about or what do they have to get ready? I feel like obviously you have to do training and stuff, but I also feel like it's really important to do it with friends and family because that's how you make all the memories. And I'm forever grateful for the memories I've made with my grandpa during awesome. my last three years of rag bra. Awesome. And you've been making some great memories. It's been fun riding with you. We'll look forward to riding again today. Today's ride takes us from Des Moines to Tama. It's about a 90 mile ride. Ride. And again, it's going to be a hot day. It's Military Appreciation Day, so you're going to see a lot of patriotic jerseys out there supporting all branches of the military. And remember, it's a long ride into Tampa, but we're finally making it into Eastern Iowa. Can't wait to get into Eastern Iowa, into the TV9 viewing area. Oh, yeah, one other thing the pie update mixed berry. That marks four slices of pie in four days. Today, we're looking for pie in Colfax. Meteorologist Joe Winters riding Ragbri will join you in Tama tomorrow morning.